He is the man who inspired the Ice Bucket Challenge. But his leadership goes far beyond that. And I think that really is the story of Pete. Great connector, great networker. In 2010, years before Massachusetts' own Pete Frades was a global force in the battle against a deadly disease, he was a gritty center fielder, still pursuing big league dreams. Frades was also a bit of a scout for Boston College coach Mike Gambino. Pete calls me and says, hey, there's this kid, um, high school kid playing for us in, Le in the Lexington Blue Sox. You gotta come see. Pete tells me to go see a guy, I go see a guy. The guy was an oversized teen named Chris Shaw, who had a talent for crushing baseball. After graduating from Lexington High in 2012, the slugger was drafted by the Mets in the 26th round. But he chose to go to Boston College, following in the footsteps of Frady's. Pete really just became sort of a role model for me. He really took me under his wing and uh, you know, he was just this type of guy that was just really somebody I wanted to look up to, just real charismatic, took care of his work in correct ways. The thing that's so special about Chris, and sort of like with Pete, that the makes, makeups are so similar. Chris is such a team guy, um, he's such a high character kid, and a lot of that is because of how much Pete has also mentored him sort of from that point. They were just destined to, to be with each other. Pete saw something in Chris at a very young age, and he um, continued to mentor him by example at first. As Shaw's college career prepared to take flight with the Eagles, Frades was delivered the grim diagnosis of ALS. He told me the news, it was just you know, one of those things, it was just like, you know, this doesn't make any sense. He's, you know, how was it happen to this type of guy? And if there's somebody who's gonna, you know, take this disease and do something positive with it, he's the type of guy, you know, just with his attitude and just the way he handles himself. Of course, Pete Frades became an international leader in the fight against ALS, inspiring a movement that raised well over $300 million for the cause. <laughs> and in his time at BC, just as Frades predicted, Shaw became a star. The outfielder is expected to be taken in the first round of the upcoming draft. You know, I think he's got a chance to someday develop uh, into a legitimate middle the order uh, power bat in the big leagues. The fact that Chris is only uh, 20, 21 years old and about to be thrust upon the major league stage as a possible first round draft pick, it just warms my heart because it just means that a little piece of Pete will travel with Chris all the way through his major league career. The path to stardom is uncertain, but if Shaw continues to reflect the character of his role model, he'll be a star no matter how well he hits.